Hey, how is it going? I am the Cosmic Turtle and thank you for joining me. So I've been planning to do this video since November, but I've only re now really had the opportunity and this is the um, <laughs> the uh, Loot Crate, which is uh, Loot Gaming. So I have looked in this crate just because of how long it's made me wait and stuff, you know, I just didn't have any patience left to wait until this video but from the next one onwards I intend to 100% not open the boxes before the recording so this is actually the November crate the tank crate which it has taken me until January to receive it I may have had it late December but I weren't sure so I'm, I can't say for certain but they made me wait at least a month and a half to two months for this crate which is just ridiculous. I still haven't had my December crate, which is stealth, I believe. So to start off with, I haven't actually looked at this yet properly anyway. So we got this uh, Call of Duty World War Two t-shirt. Uh, some free guys in the tank. It's all right. I'm, I'm not really a big Call of Duty fan. I'll probably wear this in the house if I do wear it. I'm not certain if I will. But you know, as far as t-shirts go, if you're a fan of Call of Duty, I think you'll like the t-shirt. If you're not like me, probably not. So next thing we got is a Gears of War frag grenade. It's like a plushy kind of thing. I don't know if you can hear that. So it's like soft and like squishy. But it doesn't like have anywhere you can like latch it onto. Like by here maybe like you could fall like a little hole there so you can just put it on the wall or something. So it's kind of like a teddy, but a teddy that won't fit in with any of your other teddies. Because I doubt you got like a smoke grenade or an incendiary grenade from Gears of War laying around. But I like it because I'm a big fan of Gears of War, but it's a bit weird, like all things considered. So the next thing we have from Wolfenstein 2 of all things. It's the last thing I expected to get from Wolfenstein. A whistle. There we go. So, works as a whistle does when you put it the right way, not do it upside down. Although it looks like it should work from both sides. Either way, like, I, I, I don't really know what I think of this one because, you know, a whistle is a bit of a weird thing to have. So, I'm keeping my favourite until last. So, we have here the. Uh, the November tank pin. I think, do they call them pins? Doesn't say. But it's a pin. You obviously... What was this? Hint. They don't want fruitcake. Oh, something about Christmas presents. Well, I didn't get it until after Christmas, so... It's a bit late on that one. A Wolfenstein poster. We're gonna be too big to open all the way out, isn't it? We got so it goes this way. So we got the main woman, and we got all the good guys down there. Pretty cool. I really enjoyed Wolfenstein too, so I don't mind getting a Wolfenstein poster. It makes up for that bloody whistle, that's for sure. And last, certainly not least, we have a little uh, Bioshock model. Uh, can I get it so you can see it? There we go. Which I really like this. I don't think it's the best Bioshock model I've seen. More people around. I'm gonna oh, shit. put the closing doors. Because I got um, a video I'd like to do in the near future showing my Bioshock things. So, you know, like, this will be a part of that video. For fuck's sake. People closing doors ruining my video. Right, there we go. But yeah, so that, that is what you get in the tank crate. You get this nice little Bioshock. Uh, I don't know if it's model or a little statuette, because it's definitely not a statue, but a little Bioshock thing here, which is my favourite thing. Not worth the asking price of £28, but you get this uh, plushy frag grenade. You get your pin, poster, your whistle. 
and a Call of Duty t-shirt. So all in all, you know, it's not like, well, it's probably my least favorite crate overall so far, but it's only my third one. Just because it's a combination of weird and almost pointless things. And then you get, you do get a nice little Bioshock model. So to end the video, because I am going to open this, I'll open him out and actually show you what he looks like. And because I have seen people selling just the little, the little big daddy on its own on eBay for like, I think it's between ten and like fifteen pounds, something like that. So that is the big daddy. He's really square. If you look at him, like he's like the telltale big daddy or something he's plastic but yeah that is it for me so i hope you know i intend to be getting these videos out regular again of course it wasn't really my fault that they broke their regularity i guess you know it was actually the company for not sending me the crate on time but if all goes well there'll be two loot crate videos coming up this month and then I'll be getting them around about the 10th of every month as usual again. But I can't guarantee that for certain. But I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more content on a daily basis. And I'll catch you in the next video. So until then, please take care.